If Donald Trump threatened to go to war with a major military power, do you think the media would be interested? Yet Hillary Clinton just did precisely that, and it's barely a footnote in the mainstream press. Take a look. You've seen reports. Russia's hacked into a lot of things. China's hacked into a lot of things. Russia even hacked into the Democratic National Committee. Maybe even some state election systems. So we've got to step up our game, make sure we are well defended and able to take the fight to those who go after us. As president, I will make it clear that the United States will treat cyber attacks just like any other attack. We will be ready with serious political, economic, and military responses. In case you missed that, Hillary just said that the next time Russia is blamed for a hack, because there's no evidence whatsoever that they were behind the DNC hack, Hillary will fight them with a military response. Fighting with a military response. That sounds a heck of a lot like a threat of war to me. Threatening to declare war on Russia. You'd think that would be a big story, right? Yet virtually no big media outlet even highlighted it. Donald Trump has been savaged for being reckless with his words, yet here we have Hillary, openly invoking military conflict with a global superpower, and the media gives her a free pass. We've had a year of hysteria over Trump starting World War III and having control over the nuclear codes, but it's not Trump who's brazenly threatening another nuclear-armed country with war. It's Hillary Clinton. Clinton is crazy. She thinks Vladimir Putin is behind literally everything, from WikiLeaks email hacks to Trump to the rise of the alt-right, with zero evidence. But the media parrots it like it's gospel. She's also perfectly prepared to launch into wars that have disastrous consequences. We came. We saw, he died. <laughs> and I want the Iranians to know that if I'm the president, we will attack Iran. We would be able to totally obliterate them. Hillary Clinton openly threatening war with Russia. And the media doesn't even report on it. But they'll continue to lecture us about how it's Trump who's being irresponsible with his rhetoric. Give me a break.